What's over there? Is that a shark? Guys, we just put this rod in. It's a big one. It's a big one. It's a big one. It's a big one. What's going on, guys? Angler's Insight here. We're on our way to Fiesta Island. We just caught a bunch of bait. It's in the back. Yeah, we're going to barbecue too. And um, it's going to be a super fun day. Hopefully, we can get on something else during the light time because last night it was an epic night. I'm going to throw in some videos. It was just super hard to film because there was not a lot of light. I couldn't get anything on camera really. Um, you could see some of the rays that I caught though, so that's what I'm going to show you guys right now. Dude, we've been looking for this for a long time. We've been out here probably 15, 16 times. Got bit two, three times. Keep getting broke off. Got our first giant stingray, and that was a small one. That one was only like 20 pounds. Let's, let's just keep fishing, see if we can get another one. Hell yeah! He's out. Let's try to get a bait out there, man. They're biting, it's starting to work out. We just had to be more prepared. Let's get it. And so, after you guys, uh saw that you know today we're gonna get back on it we're gonna try to get on something during the daytime hopefully we can do it we came out earlier we just finished getting bait it's three o'clock we're gonna try to hopefully get on a fish by five no by like seven we'll still have daylight by seven o'clock and you guys i gotta turn off the camera i'm driving and i probably shouldn't be doing this right now i'll see you guys in just a little bit later so you know, look. Juicy. How you like that, Uncle John? You like that? Pikachu. Mmm. Falling apart. Mmm. There he is. Guys, I hooked into something. I don't know what. I don't know what I hooked, guys. All right, so we're just gonna fight him. Not gonna run too hard. Hopefully see if he gets another run out. But he ran hard that first time. He did not, did not give me a chance. I was just, whew, I was lucky enough to hook him, honestly. So let's just see if we can get him in. I'm running him in. He's kind of swimming towards us right now. I'm starting to feel some pressure. I think he's digging in. I think. I'm thinking Stingray because he feels close to the bottom. He feels really close to the bottom and I'm feeling a lot of weight. Yeah. <sighs> Guys, this is tiring. This is no joke. This is a big rod. It's not no little rod, guys. Got a seven foot, extra heavy. I got this Daiwa reel on here. It's rated 40 to 65 pound braid. I got 50 pound braid on here for the leader and the main line. Two ounce pyramid weight. 
separated by a separated by a uh, swivel and oh he just hit some grass or something he is in there this one's big it's big it's big big Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Might be a shark. Oh no, it's a bat rate. Oh, it's a giant bat rate. Look at that. Still running. Still running, guys. Let's go this way, baby. He's swimming now to the left. All right, guys, we just gotta take our time, go real slow, keep pressure on him. He'll let us know when he's ready. It's a nice size bat. All right, let's see, let's see what happens. Babe, this might be a PB, this is a PB. This is a new PB. This is a new PB. Yes, he is that big, babe. He is that big. He is that big. Oh, oh yeah. Wow. Guys, now is that a freaking ray or what? Hold on, let me grab the line. Oh. Get him up on shore. All right, hold it. Guys, this is not gonna do it justice. Look at my foot. Look at my foot compared to this. For a picture? Do you want me to stop recording for a picture? This thing weighs 40, 50 pounds. I'm not trying to keep him out of the water for too much longer. But you can get him right back in. I can barely carry this guy, guys. He is so heavy. So fun. Worth the fight. He's out of here. He's gone. <laughs> That was another good release. Guys, we've been here for only maybe an hour and a half. No, maybe two hours now. So we're just going to keep recording. I'm going to film an outro pretty soon. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned. It's not over. So I'm here. I'm going to show you guys the bait that we've been using. Some mackerel. Good sized mackerel. Nothing small, you know. We're chopping these guys in half and using either the head or the tail. Warning, don't watch if you're uh, squeamish. <laughs> but then we got these big old circle hooks, guys. I think it's a, uh, I don't even know what gauge, but they're really big. I just went off size. I uh, don't know the exact size, sorry. But putting it on the bait about midway through, poking it in and it's a circle hook. So you should line it up and just rotate it through the the bait and it'll come out find it and find it's out then we get this beast of a pole if i can handle this weight we get really close up get as close as we can right before we can cast What's over there? Is that a shark?
You guys ready for this? Oh, it's a shark! Oh my god! <gasps> oh, it's a freaking leopard shark! Oh my god! Dang, it's a freaking leopard shark, dude. Careful, baby. Somebody take a picture. Look, look, look. Guys, are you recording, yeah. babe? Yeah, I'm Have recording. You been, you've been recording? Okay. Guys, it just took off. I couldn't believe it. We're here with some friends. We're just hanging out. We just caught a nice, like, five foot leopard shark, probably. I don't know. It was really fun. But this is going to end the video. This was uh, pretty cool. We'll catch you guys next time. Later. Woo.